I hope that you are done with your entrance examination and now you are with your rank and the main part that comes to is the counseling procedure. So guys let me tell you that you may suck at counseling if you don't know these things that I will be telling you in this video. So watch this video till end and please like and subscribe to get further updates regarding architecture examination. Hi, what up there? So you are watching Atmosphere and in this video, we will be talking about the counseling procedure of IIT mains paper to BR. Let me tell you about myself. I am a student from School of Planning and Architecture and currently doing BR from SPA. During my counseling uh, of BR thing, I was very unaware of the fact what I have to do for the counseling procedure because this is the question that everyone have and the information that is available on the net is regarding the counseling overall it's not about the specific counseling of BR how it should be done the first counseling that you have to focus on is JOSA JOSA is the counseling authority and the full form of JOSA is joint seat allocation authority second counseling is CSAB which is central seat allocation body you might not need CSAB if you are satisfied with your college but if you are not then CSAB is for you talk about this later so first discuss about what is JOSA after getting your rank and after getting your marks you have to go for the counseling and you have to register on josa website link of the website is given in the description you have to use the same username and password that we have given in the iit mains to register in josa website after registration you have to select colleges according to your preferences you have to select the colleges according to your preference and uh, this is called choice filling choices made should be in order or for example if i want school of planning and architecture delhi at first i will place school of planning and architecture at first second i want school of planning and architecture bhopal i will be placing school of planning and architecture bhopal next to school of planning and delhi that will be related to choice filling it will be your choice you can set preference according to yourself while filling the colleges, be sure that it should be according to your list because uh, if by mistake you did something, then you will regret about the choice filling. But I want to make sure that the choices can be changed and altered at stages of counseling. The third thing will be announcement of seat allotment. So at the first round, you have to sign in and then they will show whether you got a seat or not. Mark my word because if you get a seat, you have to pay the fees. If you won't pay the fees, at next counselling, you might get out of the counselling. So this is the main thing that you should know. Because sometimes people don't know when to pay the fees. That is the main problem that happened to people. So as soon as you got the seat, you have to pay the fees. And the fees will be around 40,000 to 30,000. It will be depend on Josa what they are asking for. Already. The fourth thing is already I have told you that you have to pay the fees, the payment of the fees. That is the main thing that you should understand. Because if you don't pay the fees at the right time, you might be out of the counseling. So be sure that you pay the fees as soon as you got the college. Example, at first round, I didn't got the college. And at second round, I got the college, then I have to pay the fees. Whether I don't want to accept that, that college, but still because I got the seat, I have to pay for it. And after that, you can choose float if you don't want to take that college. Guys, there are three terms that you should understand. What is freeze and what is float and what is slide. At the time of the counseling, if you get a college, you have three options, whether you have to freeze, whether you have to float or whether you have to slide. So the freeze option is off that I accept this college and I don't want to go for further counseling. I'm satisfied with this college and going to take this college in that department. That is BR because I, we are talking about IIT Mays paper too. So float is basically that you got a college but you want to wait till you get a better college according to your preference list. The next thing that we will talk that is slide. That is the third thing. I have given IIT Mays paper too only then it won't be available for you I guess because this is the first time that IIT mains paper 2 and paper 3 is separated so you have only one program that is of BR you won't choose for B planning so slide is basically for those people who want to take admission in a college but if they can get a better branch in the same college they will go for further counseling so 
there is no point of uh, considering slide this time i guess because slide won't fit for the people who have given only it paper to because you will be going for only br colleges and there will be only br ranking and there will be only one program that is of br let's talk about josa 2020 so in 2020 josa there will be two mock round mock mock round there will be two mock round and uh, there will be seven counseling round so let me clear you guys that please don't lose hope and uh, go till the end of the counseling that is the advice that i want to give you because at the end what happens is that people don't hope for uh, their colleges so imagine that you are getting a college that you uh, wanted but you are not willing that much according to the preference list the one that comes above that you are not getting that till fifth round you so at the end you will be losing your hope and you will be saying that okay i will just freeze this college and i will go to uh, the reporting center to just confirm this college but let me clear you guys that you are wrong at that point there are many times that people vacate their seat for uh, some other reasons and go till the end of the counseling because that is very important to get the desired college that you want and please don't settle in less if you are getting something more so this counseling is over then you have to report to the reporting center that will be allotted to you and that and you have to take the documents with you while going to the reporting center you have to verify those documents because that is very necessary and the document that you have to take is given in this list so these are all the document that you have to take with you while going to the reporting centers after the document is verified and you are satisfied with your college you can approach to the college that is allotted to you and the college that you wanted will be yours so guys let me tell you that the reporting center is different and the college allotted will be different it might be a chance that they may be same but reporting center is where you have to verify your document and the allotted college will be the college that you are taking admission in and you have to first go to the reporting center to verify the document and then and then after that there will be a date that will be given to you that will be provided by the college that you have been allotted at that date you have to go and verify your document in that college that is allotted to you so guys under josa 2020 there are nine nits and there are three spas and there are many other colleges of architecture in total there are 946 seats of architecture that will be available in josa counseling so guys this is all about josa counseling and now we will talk about those who are not satisfied with their college and uh, even for those who haven't got any college in the counseling what they can do this is the main point that you have to understand because there are many ways while doing your counseling you have shown your potential you have got your marks you have got your rank but the counseling procedure is very complicated so josa part is done i hope that you are cleared with the josa part now we will talk about csab in the next video the word is that the main thing that you have to focus in is counseling because you have already got your marks you have already got your rank so there will be no point discussing about that just focus on the counseling procedure and you will definitely kill it and you will definitely get the college that you want i hope you like this video hope that this video helped you a lot for your counseling procedure uh, if you like this video please hit like button please subscribe this channel it will help me a lot and please press the notification bell to get further updates thank you for watching see you next time